And she can talk all your shit, you know. And she, when I was in California, I told this fucking bitch, then Barbara, I'm gonna write stuff. And when he goes to your office, you print them off for me. So I'm writing all kind of shit. I don't want the fucking bitch. What's doing to me? She's going back and forth to the people and say, so look what he come out is writing about you. She go tell billionaire Jim Buzz too. She don't know them, you know. She go tell all kind of motherfucker. I've been for a lot of shit, you know. Just like what my wife, baby mother did to me. Same shit. In this motherfucker business. Your fantasy. Mm-hmm. Huh. And you the other side of it too. Prejudice. No. See how you motherfucker talking about? My book coming out. It's like um 160 pages. My baby mom. California Palms Hotel they put me. Okay? We're going to edit it. Mm -hmm. Talk about this chick lioness who fucked me up. No, I'm a terrible four. You don't know? Okay. Talk about the Marlies. The others. Okay. Bitch named Barbara. Talking about her too. Okay. Making a fucking thing. Jennifer Swift. Priscilla Lane. My baby mom. Sisters, the newfound sisters. Mm -hmm. Billionaire Jim Buff. Welcome to Jollywood. A lot more shit in this motherfucker here. Mm -hmm. Amanda Rudder. Charged me for rape and kidnapping. Mm -hmm. Tribute to me, this fucking tribute band in America. More tribute to e-commerce and e-commerce. Ain't even fucking dead. You know that motherfucker? Mm -hmm. Rick Bracamantes. Booking agent. The Marley Boys. Okay. Let me tell you about this motherfucker. Hands up, don't fucking shoot. You see? Mm -hmm. Why keep my fucking book in? It's about. I need. It's about 65 pages. I need about 180 pages, which is coming up, you know, because when I write on this motherfucker, you know, I don't stop writing, you know, you know that? I gotta watch my cell phone, because I know that you motherfucker wanted to steal my cell phone and take my fucking shit, you know that? Europe, I love Europe. And three of many black people came when America said, fuck you, you come from World War II, war or Vietnam. I'll fight for your fucking country. You still a fucking slave in America. Huh? Josephine Baker. Hmm? The fuck? I said, come on, come to Europe. Uh -uh. Tina Turner. Nigga was beating the fuck out of her. Come to Europe. Married to a white man. Jack Johnson. First nigga heavyweight champion. Mm -hmm. He said, oh, the Russians them treat me very good. I love the Russian. They took away his passport. Now he married to that white woman. They said, fuck, nigga, no, you're going to die. Louis Armstrong. <laughs> you know, John Coltrane, all ah, these motherfuckers, you know. It's what going on in America. They kill niggas. So it was the right thing they did when they kicked me out of America illegal. A sick bitch named Barbara. What she did to me? Let me get snippets of it. Oh, baby. Why not change your eek me record? Or eat me. Eek me record. That's my company. To eat commerce entertainment. This my Nigerian's boss. She work with some fucking Nigerians. Named Ambrose. And a lot of more Nigerians in the casinos and they got their suit on and they ain't going nowhere. Mm -hmm. 
So if some of you Nigerians want to be offended, fuck you. Um, some of you are some bunch of fucking thieves and think that, oh, ow. Do my shit. Blah, blah. Let's talk our shit. Oh, do, 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 do you know you owe me a hundred thousand dollars? I said, for what? You say I can get you the port anytime I want. I'm the motherfucker. I said, so I'm the fucking joking. You know? And as soon as I left that bitch, I said, fuck you. When I come to Europe, go buy a bitch car, the old office, da, 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 next to the beach in, 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 um, in Venice Beach. I see that a television with about seven channels, never know fucking cable. But they look classy and the bitch was so fucking trash. This motherfucking book here. Come in the fuck out. You, 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 you think this is suck cock, Kimani, big pussy Marley. Kimani Marley wrote a book. Dear Dad, hmm? Kimani Marley, suck my dick. It should be. Dear, it should be, dear mom, why did you fuck Bob Marley and get pregnant on a one night stand? Mm, you didn't know that motherfucker? Yes. So Barbara was working with these fucking Nigerians, man. These Nigerians had some, uh, had a, uh, uh, they sell medical equipment across the racetrack from Hollywood. Casino, and they were doing nothing to fuck. And these fucking Nigerians, they were ripping off the American government when the tax time come, and her fucking daughter named Anastasia White. She don't work in her. But she collects $3,000 every fucking year from the government. Juice that tax fraud, you go to prison, bitch. She's telling her daughter how to steal a fucking rental car. And her daughter is seven months pregnant in jail for car insurance fraud. Mm hmm Think she could have get away with that shit. So that's what the fuck I've been motherfucking through. My fucking book. You know this motherfucker inside you we got there. Mm-hmm. Yeah? And who's helping me write this book? Long legs. White man. See? Great, powerful, fucking white man. Mm. Yeah. I'm going to say some motherfucker. She ain't your woman. Okay, okay. She's my woman now, okay? What the fuck you think? You can't show her? The fucking niggas there, man. <laughs> so, so what these fucking niggas? They think they can't show the woman, you know? You know that? They think they don't control women. They control women. And they, if you're dating his ex babe mother or ex babe wife, they hate you, you know. That's what niggas are. In Jamaica, the same shit too. This guy, you know the guy, but the guy for a long time, the guy is dating his girl after they left. And if the guy don't know his girlfriend, he, he don't want to talk to the guy. But the white men are so civilized. Mm -hmm. They say the white men come from cave. If the white men came out of the cave, where we niggas come where we niggas came from? The bushes. Well, 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 well. <laughs> yes, motherfucker. The white man said, honey, I'm getting married, you know. Your ex-wife said, Oh, I'd love to meet I love to meet that nice lady. He said, Oh. You can bring your new husband to or your, or your boyfriend to the wedding. Civilized, but not niggas. Niggas think with their fucking dick. You know that? Think the bigger the dick, the power, the more power it is. My fucking book coming out on what my baby mom did to me in America. And they took my $4.5 million. So I'm writing about this shit. This book coming out. Any motherfucker who fuck me the fuck up. This is legal slandering. Which is admissible in court. And if you can prove being a reasonable doubt that these motherfucker fuck you up, they said Rick Bracamantes, who was sending money to my babe mom, without my knowledge, they didn't know. Money, wire transaction, Western Union, tax, 
Fox. <laughs> Motherfucker faxed me once and said, Oh, I'll get you deported, you know. I said, What? Response in my visa. Mm -hmm. Fuck, man. <laughs> well, that's what happened. I did one of these California palms. It was a roach motel. I was in the California palm. This a girl from the manager put place me there. Miles, we're gonna find you an apartment. They got horses, properties, clubs for 11 months. I was lucky to find a house myself. And they got this girl going around here. Oh, I'm trying to find your apartment, Miles. He said, no, don't find that nigga nothing. I want that nigga money. And I want that nigga kill it. But he was like the weak niggas. Like he, 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 he. had a nigga named Pato Bantam, an artist. Pato Bantam got two wives. And the fucking white boy found Pato Bantam a house. Didn't find nothing. The California Palms and Harbour Boulevard in Costa Mesa. A kitchenette. One fucking bed. Mm-hmm. Yep. With the three little boys. And the motherfucker that prostitute outside of the street. Pimps, drug dealers. Roach crawling up the fucking walls and playing in my fucking kids' toys. You didn't know that motherfucker? And I trust these fucking motherfuckers. Who would fucking me the fuck up? Mm hmm. That's what that means? Then they went to my friend Jim Boss. Yeah? Jim Boss. Billionaire, billionaire Jim Boss. You hear me talking about him all the while, huh? Owner of the Los Angeles Lakers basketball fucking team. I even talking about the virus, you know? You know that? <laughs> I can see what the fuck we got here, like, right? Mm -hmm. All these motherfuckers, you know? That's what we got. Mm -hmm. So you see this shit here? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, this fat fuck, him name? Tell about him too. Oh. Uh, him name, my professor. He fucked me up too, you know. He said, Mouse, when you go to Brazil, try to find these two guys. I found them. My name is Dub Master, one of my donors. Okay, I said, okay. <laughs> these two motherfuckers end up kicking me out of them fucking house and I me walk in the fucking street. Uh, as soon as I get them signed to VP Records. VP Records, accountant, chief accountant, and fucking uh, 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 president of record label, Olivier Chastan. Motherfucker fucked me up in Brazil too. The record label executive, you know? Fuck me the fuck up. I'll be walking the street of Brazil homeless as fuck. You don't know that? That did it to me. And a fucking white boy named Dobitarian, the commandant, Mark Richard Brenner. I got him, had him sign with VP Record. I'm recording song at his house.